Sam, how you doing? This is your man, Jimmy L. Anderson, coming at you. And you know how we do. And today on the menu, we about to set it off with today's special, Aki Gwen's Grilled Lamb Chops, Exotic Rice, Cucumber Tomato, and Onion Salad. Now fam, before we even get started, let me break it down to you. Some of this stuff, because of the purpose of time, I had to go ahead and get started. Like with that cucumber and tomato and onion salad, I had to get that in there so it could chill a little bit, as well as the exotic rice. Now, with the exotic, exotic rice, I actually picked this rice up in the, in the Amish community. I mean, they got some good stuff out there, and it's real cheap. In addition to that, got a little saffron and a little olive oil that I'm going to mix that up and get that started. But, let's focus on the lamb chop. You know what I'm saying? Here's my seasons. All right. Got a little salt. All right. A little cumin, a little, uh, a little Cuban season, a little smoked paprika, a little garlic, a little, a little parsley flakes, a little, you know, just a little bit of anything and everything, you know what I'm saying, because we about to hook this up. Now, here we go, take a little of the season here, got my little lamb chop right here, and, and which has been washed, oh, almost messed up, got to get my olive oil on there, want to get both sides on there, and so. Just like that. Now I'll go ahead and start the season process. Get a little salt on there. A little flakes. A little dry garlic. And you can also use the optional, you can go with the uh, fresh garlic. Paprika. Come on. A little Cuban seasoning, you know, for the life of me, and a little oregano. That's what that was. Dry oregano. In addition to that, got some fresh parsley. Now, I don't want to chop up the parsley, I just want to kind of peel it apart just like that. And so, you know what I'm saying? Also, got a little mint. what I use for this got a little rosemary fresh rosemary got a little lemon juice a little green onions and a little pepper ground pepper what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the other side you know what I'm saying and then I'm gonna go ahead and start the grilling process. So y'all just stay tuned and be be cool and we'll be right back. Hey, what's up fam? We on the grill, we're getting right down and dirty. Now I went ahead and had the pork chop marinate a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Now what I'm gonna do, you only cooking like about four minutes on each side, all right? Depending on how you like it, you know what I'm saying? Now, also what I did is took some of that, that olive oil and some of that meat, and this is how I'm starting my gravy, and I added all these different seasons up in here. Just like that, you know what I'm saying? And we in business. What I use with this gravy, I use some chicken stock, you know what I'm saying, and a little white wine. Let's see what else I threw up in there. I got some, as you can see, I got some parsley in there, I got some onions in there. I got some, let's see here, some flour, a little flour in there. I'm hooking at a little caper. That's a little round thing you see up in there. Fans, hold on tight and we'll be right back. Hey, what's up, fam? Welcome back. Well, another done deal. You know what I'm saying? Today we start off with a little Auntie Gwen's grilled lamb chops with some exotic rice, some cucumber, tomato, and onion salad. Well, this goes out to you, Auntie Gwen. Y'all be cool out there, and I'll be back next week, and we'll hook something else up. Until then, y'all be cool, y'all be safe, and stay vigilant. Peace out.